Hi, I'm Adam with We Light Up the Night, and today we're going to talk about how to troubleshoot a tube television set. I have here in front of me a slightly older style uh, tube TV. One of the first things that I recommend trying to correct problems with your picture is, particularly on older models, you'll have these knobs for horizontal and vertical holds. Uh, these knobs just rotate clockwise or counterclockwise and will make fine adjustments to the picture. If you have something like a rolling image where it just keeps going top to bottom or side to side, uh, these knobs can be used to help adjust that and you can just usually turn them with your finger. Um, if that doesn't correct your problem, another thing that you can look at is the terminals on the back of the set. Uh, you'll see that this unit has some wires that go into screw terminals for UHF and VHF connections. You may have a F style or cable uh, connector on the back of your set and you just want to make sure that all of the cable connectors are securely tightened uh, and in place. So I'm going to do that on my connectors using a screwdriver. And that may improve the quality of your picture. Um, the last thing that you want to do is you can look at the electrical cord coming out of your unit. Uh, if you have animals, animals can frequently chew through these wires and that would cause a break in the connection where your TV would not be turning on at all. So you just want to check down the length of the cord and make sure there are no um, cuts or breaks or even places where it could have gotten um, pressed against the wall or underneath your entertainment center um, that could also cause a break in the wire. So we'll check the length of the cord for that and hopefully one of those methods will restore image back to your television set. If none of these methods return picture to your TV and you are inclined to open the set, you can do so and look for a few things, but I highly recommend that you only do this as a, an advanced user with some electrical knowledge because there are a lot of components inside the television set that can be very dangerous. They produce high levels of electrical energy and you can be electrocuted. Having said that, we have removed the screws to the casing of this TV and we can now pull off the back and have a look inside. Once we are inside the TV, you can look for any indications of electrical discoloration, brown spots, black spots, um, where something may have sparked inside. Uh, you can look for wires that could have melted or broken or wires with connectors that have come loose and just carefully look around the inside and replace any wires that may have slipped off of their connector. But you really want to look out for right around the tube itself. You'll see this piece that looks like a suction cup going back to some electronics on the circuit board. This piece down on the circuit board is called a flyback transformer and it's capable of producing thousands of volts of electricity. You want to steer clear of this device at all costs. Touching any exposed area of the wiring connecting the tube of your television to the flyback transformer is very likely to electrocute you. So please be very careful inside your TV set. Um, that's about as far as I'd recommend any average user going. So hopefully one of these methods has helped you restore image back to your television set. Thanks for watching How to Troubleshoot Your Tube TV. I'm Adam with We Light Up the Night.